Hi, I'm Robert from Move Work Forward. In this video, we're going to cover how to integrate Azure DevOps pipelines with Bitbucket Data Center. You can find a link to our post webhooks for Bitbucket application on the Atlassian Marketplace in the description below. So to begin, we are in our repository settings in our Bitbucket project and go to post webhooks on the left under workflow and then click on create a new webhook. For the incoming webhook URL, go to the pipeline in question in Azure DevOps and copy the URL. So these are our pipelines. This is the testing pipeline we are going to use and we are just going to copy this URL. For the payload type, select Azure. You want to source as cloud. Then you want to enter your personal access token. For the target Azure DevOps branch, we will leave it as our default, which is master. And then you can select the parameters to send. The important thing to note about these parameters is they must also be set up in the DevOps pipeline so they can be tested. So on the pipeline, click on edit, select the variables tab, and ensure all the relative parameters are settable at queue time. Without these set, Azure will decline the webhook and nothing will happen. And in repository settings, you can test the connection. The test connection button won't be available for project or global settings, but the process is still the same. Now we'll scroll down and provide a suitable name and save our connection. Now, if we go back to our pipelines, we can see the most recent run. If we go into it, you will see there are no parameters listed. So we'll go back to Bitbucket and just make a commit message. Now, if we go back to our pipelines, we can see a new run just now. And now we can see the parameters we specified listed. And that's how you integrate Azure DevOps pipelines with Bitbucket. Thanks.